Chinese startup Step Fun has launched and made open source their latest text to video model. This model is 30 billion parameters and it has the capability to generate videos up to 204 frames. If you consider 30 frames per second for a typical video, this uh, it can generate up to 6 to 7 seconds of videos. They have a website where they have shown the videos which have been generated using this particular model. So here is a prompt which says the video shows a yellow racing car speeding on a high speed track floating in the clouds. Okay, the track winds and stretches above. So here is the video which has been generated. Right. So this is an imaginative video. Right. Now you have another video, a realistic video of a person playing a piano. An older man plays the piano with the light shining from the side. So if you look at this video, you can see the light, the physics, as other aspects of the fingers playing over the piano. Everything looks really good. There is one more example over here of a race. Right. So the video shows a clip of a woman's 5000 meter race. The camera follows the athlete at a very high angle. The picture is clear. So here you can see that the physics and other things have been captured very well over here. The human anatomy. Maybe that clarity on the face is not there because it's from a high angle. But uh, this video is quite interesting. Now, how much GPU is required or what is the memory GPU memory requirements for this particular model? So if you look over here, you require at least 77.64 GB. So the recommended NVIDIA GPU is an 80 GB GPU for you know better generation quality at least use gpus with 80 gb so how much uh, amount of uh, you know gpus were required to uh, generate this particular model uh, so they have released this paper where they've given all the details of how this model has been developed what is the kind of training data which was used over here so here they say that they have created a data center of thousands of nvidia h800 gpus to train these models okay so this is a very interesting development from a chinese startup so this is an open source model it has an mit license which means that you can use it for commercial use right um, you can distribute it you can modify it um, the weights are already released over here so people can look at how they can improve this particular model or even fine tune it on a certain particular um, domain right or however you want so this is a very interesting development uh, from this startup called Step One. So I was looking a little bit into details to understand more about this startup. And it says that this is a Shanghai based AI startup Step One and Geely Auto. So probably Geely Auto is the parent company of Step One. So they have unveiled two open source multi-model AI models on Tuesday. Um, so this is like the next deep seek in the video generation space. Uh, so one is your whatever I was been discussing till now, which is the open source video generative model. And the other one is an advanced auto voice. Probably I'll cover in another video. So Hugging Face founder says that, um, you know, step one looks like the next deep seek. So this particular video model, which we were looking at step video T2V, uh, this is Sora like it's the world's largest and highest performing open source video generation model. Same uh, with 30 billion parameters, whatever I've been talking before. So it can directly generate 204 frame, 540p resolution videos, ensuring exceptional information density and temporal consistency. It demonstrates strong performance in complex motion, aesthetic human figures, visual imagination, basic text generation. It supports both Chinese and English input and cinematographic language according to step fun. Okay. So that is what we looked at. They have so many examples over here. You can actually create an account over here with a mobile number. And I see many countries are supported over here. I've not yet created an account. Probably I might create and try it out. Okay. But the videos which are present over here are very interesting. So this uh, open sourcing of models from China is a welcome development from these Chinese labs. This will really push further development of these models. This is a very interesting development. Uh, hope you like this video. See you in another video.